Uh, hi everyone and assalamualaikum and as I promised uh, earlier this is probably my second part of uh, the video that where I'm going to install this uh, uh, waste disposal uh, in sink corrector and um, and uh, for this installation uh, there will be three stages okay uh, one of course we have to install this um, uh, in sink corrector under my sinky and uh, I will also uh, explain in detail later how we can fit this one under under the sink and uh, where is the location and every everything and uh, the second part is that I have to install the 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 air uh, air switch we call it air switch then uh, the air switch require uh, a drilling and all that and so that I can mount the the, the switch on on my sinky on my sink uh, but uh, that's a bit tough job because uh, the sink is itself uh, is made from stainless steel then uh, when we need to drill whatsoever we need to use a proper tools in order for us to to do the, the drilling to do the, the to make the hole for for the for the air switch you know and uh, get to the second station the third station will be i have to pull uh, my power uh, for for the for the machine you know for the machine uh, without the power definitely the machine cannot work and uh, I see at uh, one point somewhere there that uh, I'm going to tap and uh, bring it under my sink and so that I can utilize that power for for the for the sink all right so without the uh, further delay let's uh, start with the installation I forgot to mention one more stage uh, where after we uh, installation complete then I have to do the connection for the piping you know and so the right piping for so yeah okay this is uh, the air switch that i'm talking about okay um a few location that i decided to to put this uh, this switch and uh, one is somewhere here and uh, and the rest of the area probably i think not really suitable but uh, i found that this area a bit narrow and and underneath then uh, and a bit difficult for me to fit in this one then uh, the best uh, the best position or uh, the best area that i can fit this switch probably around here clearance for for the installation and uh, all the thing underneath were the earlier was clear and uh, also this, this piping uh, all this piping will be uh, customized in order to fit to the sinkerator you know and uh, of course this one will be removed and uh, we have to make another uh, set of piping Okay, now I have to remove uh, this part in order for me to install the polygon. This is the bottom part of the sinky and you have to clear, you know. You have to remove all necessary to your, your area. See at the the dirty this one. So I can see that here already clear so that you can uh, put in the The process. So I I decided to go for the first uh, second stage of the installation where I have to fit this uh, air switch. Uh. Okay, first of all uh, we have to draw the uh, hole. You know, the, draw the mark the, the hole that we're going to to get uh, the hole cutter uh, from the hardware shop, and uh, it cost me thirty bucks on uh, this one. But I'm not very sure whether this one can. Uh, can really make a hole to the this uh, stainless steel uh, uh, plate here. But they give a try and see what uh, what happened and uh, uh, hopefully you also can help me. Do. Uh, let's see whether it can a hole. Better. See the smoke come out. Put again the oil. So it's 
can see the hole is ready and uh, I can start to, to put in the the air switch into the hole okay, we can uh, put this thing uh, the, the, the plunger for the air hose uh, the air switch and at the same time we put this one so this is uh, how the, the the air switch will look like you know so the next we have to go with the the, the main device to be installed under the sink the device is come with uh, several parts then uh, of course you got to understand each of the part before installation uh, begin you know so for instance this uh, the this, this top part actually is to be mounted uh, on top of the on top of the uh, sink so that uh, you have to make the proper preparation uh, for the installation uh, before you can fit into the, the sink alright so this is the top part of the so I think uh, we have to use it uh, the screw and the proper screw to get it uh, loosened and uh, to get the Uh, the, the top part of the I can already take out this the top part just now and uh, now I can have this one to be mount on top of the on the thing to lock and uh, together with the the locking uh, this one eh? so that the, the this one will be locked Okay, again, before we start to install it, make sure we do the final cleaning for the for the sink. Uh, no water can access through this one. And also, we have to check uh, necessary uh, accessory given. Uh, this uh, rubber, I believe, is to be fit here. Huh? To be fit here so that uh, we'll uh, stop any access for the for the so once you secure the this one all right so we can start put in this uh, into the sink properly all right and uh, the second washer here just put at the bot underneath at the bottom and uh, uh, follow with this one okay uh, then follow with this uh, lock here then you can Once this this is pin is ready, lock this one. Uh, it is secure the position of the the top part uh, right at the center. We have to make sure this is very strong, uh, lay mount, and uh, because this is going to be holding the the whole device, you know, because the, the device is quite heavy, you know, it's not properly mount this one, then uh, probably it might 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 drop, and and also. With the with the with the high speed motor spinning underneath, then uh, a better make sure that this uh, the, the the this is properly mount uh, at the below of the sink and uh, a secure tighten properly so that it won't run or it won't uh, move away. So our next step is to install this uh, device. Okay, then. Um, uh, we have to make sure that the two part uh, ready. Okay, alright. And uh, one and uh, so this is probably once we lock, then we will, we will secure. And uh, what we have to do, we have to then start to turn this. What we call the locking here. Uh, we just make sure the position of the uh, that we want. You know, position of the piping. The one then uh, then only we lock the okay it's done now i think it's uh it's secure mounted off this is uh how the thing look like next step we have to install this one then uh, uh the position is supposed to be like this you know and uh, from this uh, the water will drain out to the the main drain point here so we have to prepare a, a piping sorry the, this one have to be fit inside here first All right. and follow with this one and this put this I hope you all can see it okay this part is already done here go out the how we can make a party connection for the for the accelerator 
So, so we get to cut this out. So, hancurkan makanan. So, uh, finally the piping connection is ready. So, the first one will be connected to the that one and uh, the main one you can see there is connected one will look like and connected directly to the to the main drain. Alright. So, uh, installation almost complete then uh, this uh, this tube actually is for the of this uh, device so that the pressure from the air switch will be, will be directly inside the that one to switch on the device all right this is this is the point where we have to fit the for the power so we have Okay, my friend, uh, my installation finally completed and uh, and uh, power is up and uh, the system is ready for the for the commission and uh, I was really excited for for this moment and uh, all the piping is properly connected accordingly and uh, as you can see, this is the 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 top part of the uh, waste disposal. And uh, this is the air switch that I'm talking about. Then, um, so the moment I press this one, the machine will surely start. And uh, I can't wait to, to hear the sound. And uh, uh, so let's give, give it a try, right? And we shall should uh, switch on the uh, uh, water, uh, the tap water. Then uh, you can press start, press the button. And let's see what happened. Ah, you can hear the sound uh, of the the machine is running. And uh, at this time, at this point, if we put anything, that way we will crush everything inside and uh, uh, convert into a small particle that in the easily drain off to the that one. So it's good. Then uh, uh, hopefully uh, this uh, video will be. Uh, helpful for those who wanted to install this uh, this uh, waste disposal. All right. Then they press one more time, it will stop the the machine. All right. So good. Okay. Ciao.